Hey Flathies, welcome back to Pink Stylist Plays. Today we're continuing our playthrough of the fabulously, hauntingly beautiful game, Creeks. Which was made by the same people that made the equally hauntingly beautiful game, Machinarium. As far as story structure goes at this point, I think we're just safe to say we're searching for a book to give to birdie creatures to hopefully put an end to the giant demony wooden creature thing that's trying to destroy our underground system of puzzles and birdie knowledge. I don't bloody know. It's a fun game. <laughs> Let's just not overanalyze it. <laughs> oh, and there's lovely artwork too. <laughs> so weird. But the puzzles are so, so difficult and I really love that. It's the kind of game where it doesn't kind of just show you step by step what to do. It just plonks you in the middle of this world and says, figure it out. And that's awesome. So let's play some more Queeks. So, elevator. It's a surprisingly long game. I mean, I don't know how long we've been playing it now. I think it's about three hours. Could be wrong. Because this type of game usually, considering how much artwork and clearly how much love has gone into it, they don't tend to be this long and... Yeah. I mean, Machinarium was quite long, wasn't it? What have we got here? Oh, another artwork. Is it a puzzle piece? No, it's not. Oh, oh wait! I have to solve it! I love it! I love it! Right, so, okay, so... <laughs> So, it's the reverse of this game. I'm playing it as the demony creature things. Oh. Okay. No, wait, no, no. It's on a pattern. Ha! Oh, this is so weird. Okay. One, two. One. All again. Okay, so I need to go there, there, and then run. Beautiful. I need to stop saying beautiful after I solve bloody puzzles. Oh, hello. One, two, stay there, stay on two, move to three, then four. Easy, okay. So one, two, stay on two, move to three, go on four. Perfect. Okay. Move to which one? Move to two, move to three, move off. That's easy. Okay. Okay. Move to two, stay. Move to three. Done. Oh wow. Okay, okay. Move to two. Move to three. Stay on three. Move back to two. Move back to three. Oh god. Okay, hang on. Move to two. Move to three. Stay on three. Move to two. Move to three. Escape. Ha! Gotcha, you bastard. Oh, I just wanted to give you love. Although that isn't what these doggy creatures do in this game. They eat you. Oh, I got an achievement for good boy. Ah. Because that would be sad if all this time, like, the jellyfish creatures, the demon doggies, and the demon coat rag things were, like, trying to be our friends, but they're really not. I'm living proof of that. They killed me enough times. Oh, that was my favourite puzzle so far! <laughs> Down we go. Oh, hello. Is this all of them? No, it's doggy creatures and coat rack demons. So, no jellyfish. Alright. Uh... I'm assuming that doggies don't like coat rat creatures because they don't like jellies. And there's a switch that lifts the thingy up down there. Okay. That's fine, I can do that. So what? what's the point of the coat rat creatures? Unless I need to separate them to separate the doggies. Let's get the other side of them first. 
put a bit more space between these two, shall we? One, two, three, four, five. So we're going to have one more space because they'll fit on the thingy that way. They'll fit on the elevator. So I need to... What do I need to do? I need to get them on the elevator and to go up, which means they need to stay put. Let me just see what this will happen. Hang on. Or do if... Okay. So I need to get too closer to them, but then I can't get past them. Oh, that's very tricky. Okay, fine. So I've got the right idea. I just need to be the other side of them. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, super close. I can get one on there. Would that matter? No, I can't get one. Oh, come on! Fine. I know what I'm doing. If that, if that, if I can get them to there, that's one, two spaces. I need to get another. Okay, if I, hmm, I, I know I'm on the right path. Would that kill me if I had turned them on now? Yes, yes, it would. <laughs> oh God, no, poo. <laughs> I got the general idea though. No, I think... No, I think I'm right. I just don't know how to get the other side of them. Unless I don't need to be the other side of them. Oh, hold on. Hang on. This might not work. <laughs> Look at the space between the doggies. One, two, three, and then the ladder, and then one, two, three, and then the doggy. I think I need to be in the middle of them. Like here. Oh god. Oh, please work. If this works, this, I'm going to be really happy if this works. If this works, I'm allowed to feel smug. As a saving symbol, so that's always good. So now I've got my own little bodyguards. Ah, I love it! Move, please! Appreach! I did it! Smug! <laughs> Smug mold. Sorry, okay, I'm done. That was good, that was very good. Oh, I love this game. Okay. Alright. Puzzle! No, art, not puzzle. More humans. Oh, there's so much hunting now. <laughs> okay, well that was lovely. <laughs> At least none of them died. Wait. Why are we going down? There's a, there's a lift there. So we're going to get down to go up. That's I do love that that it shows like future points like of next puzzles like I mean the future puzzle because at some point I'm gonna have to go well I'm gonna have to go across here up then down again then across again and then up to get to the top part there I love that and there's no loading screens it's all one big game and oh hello oh it's the opposite look so that moves in the opposite direction and I got a lovely fabulous coat interesting so there's a doggy up there. I need to get on the button. But if I move, I will die if I get one close to them. Very clever. Okay, let's try this way then. Oh, I like that one. That's fabulous. Oh, wait, wait. Wait, what? Why did the light go out? It's a timer! Go. Run, 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 run. I'm super confused. And then it goes off. And that lifts up the thing. I need to get the dog to walk on the light. And then I can push the dog on the button whilst it turns into the side table. Don't I? 
and then I have to... Oh, wow, that is really tricky. Okay, but I don't know where to start with this then. Because there's no way I'd have enough time to get up the ladder while the timer's going off, which means that doesn't need to be on then, which means I need to be up there while the light's off. And I can't change the distance between me and the opposite Korak demon. So it means I have to go up there. There's no other way. Oh! Oh! Uh -oh. One, two, three. One, two, three. There's four spaces between me and... Oh, that's going to be difficult. I've got to let Doggy chase me. Watch. Oh, no! Oh, I did it wrong! Did I do it wrong? The doggy would kill me by the time I got a chance to even... No! Although, no, I can't get up that ladder. Shoot. Oh, wait! No, I think I've got it! Watch. Watch, 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 watch. Go on, go back. One, two. Okay, go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. Oh, no! No, 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 I've got it, I've got it. That is right, that is definitely bloody right. Freeze the doggo, jump over the doggo, get down the ladder and be the opposite side of opposite Korak Demon. Got it! Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Watch, so get Doggy to chase me. Hey Doggy, chase me. Wait for Doggy to go back. Be very quick this time. Come on. Go. Go, 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 go. That is not enough time. I'm doing something wrong here. I'm sure that's right, though. I need more distance between me and Coat Rack Demon. There's no other way of doing it. I need to be up the ladder whilst they stand on it. And the only way to do that is if I had more distance. Why isn't it moving? Because the light's on it. So what's the advantage to that? Oh, it's dropped the... Oh, hang on. That's how I do it. One, two, three. That gives me three extra spaces. Clever. Very, very clever. So now, if I were to do that, and then wait for it to go, then again, that gives me a couple of extra seconds. No, it doesn't. It gives me permanent time. That is very, very good. Done. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. Oh, oh, oh. Cutscene. What's the other birdie going to try now? <laughs> Shoot it with forks and spoons. That works, I suppose. But his friends are going to sabotage it again. Why, though? I don't get what they were sub to do. They're definitely his friends because they're right there at the start. I think. Oh, oh! Whoa! You might want to move. Oh, hello! Oh no! Oh, good. Oh, it's, look, it's the first time you've seen its face properly! Creepy. I don't think it's any kind of creature. I think it's just it's. Ugh. It's kind of a max mix up of like a ton of creatures. Nice. Another reverse Korak demon. And there's the book. Sugar. So if I. No. Bugger. Even the laugh thing is isn't like someone speaking. That's that's a like a on a violin strings or something. It's all done instrumental. It's really really clever. Um, what do you turn into then? A really posh coat rack. I love it. Bye. I could unlike turn you off and let you wander around up there, but no. She'll live forever as coat rack now. No. Po. Ah, uh, rude. Thank you. Oh. 
art or puzzle? Looks like a puzzle. Kitty! Wait. I'm not controlling this, no. I'm just watching it, okay. That's fine. Kitty in a tree. No longer kitty in a house. Oh. Oh, no, I am controlling it. Uh, door number three. Door number one. No, bad door, bad door, bad. Number two. And then back here again. Number three. Number two. Oh, God. Nope, bad. Number two. Oh, it was a switch. Wait. Wait, what? But I can't go there. So that's, that's, okay. So door number one. Door number two. Nope. Oh, wait, no. Is that good or bad? There's a kitty! Okay. I'm guessing I was meant to go, like, run really fast to get through that, but I don't know how to get there, so let's just do this first. And that gets him to move. Oh, this is so clever! Oh my god. This is actually really tricky. And there you go. This has got, like, Rusty Lake vibes. But like Rusty Lake, um, uh, White Door, was it? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I'm so confused. I can't get past there. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Oh, God, I'm going to die. Oh, bridge. Okay, so now I do know what to do. <laughs> I know I had to get there now. Fine. There's so many layers to this game, it's insane. So, I pull that. No, don't do that. And then that. Oh no, that's not where I want it to be. Yes, it is. Back through there. Back through there. Back through there. Do that. Nope. Through there. Through there. Through there. Go. Yes! Beautiful! Look at that! Oh. But where's the kitty? Kitty! Where are you, you little shit? Cat's bag. Oh, well, he's got the achievement. Now they do that again. Don't go in scary trees. Totally worth the achievement. You're a good kitty. Don't worry. Let me carry on painting you. Yeah. It's a new series. Charlie translates. Really scary, creepy cartoons. Here we go. I'm liking this. No baddies. No more Kyrak Demons. I spoke too soon. One opposite Kyrak Demon. Oh, look! Okay, so we have two. One normal and one opposite. So I can separate them. If I put them together. Well, let's see what these buttons do then. So that lets them out. Now there's no space between them. Okay. Well, I can't go down there, which means I need to figure out what that does. Um. Yellow. I need to get that yellow switch, which goes all the way down there, which is you. Shit, they're currently on it! I need to get down there somehow. How? Okay, so I think this is a good start. 
but I have no way of getting down and no way for them to get up. Other than... Oh, there is a way. Other than this. So I need to put one between us. Okay, easy peasy. So I need to go one... Yeah, like that. Then do, do, do... Okay. Do I need to get my friend up there as well? It does look like I do. That's how you get that one up there. Smokes. Let's leave you there. No, I need it across one more. And then... Perfect, but now I do need you over there. Oh, this is tricky. Now you're trapped. <laughs> okay, so that's what I want. So now I need to go the complete opposite side. And then you're trapped, which means I can now... Okay. Think, think, think. Come on, brain. So if I need to go one, two, I would go like that. So I can go that way. So I need to put you down. And go back. One, two... Go one, no, 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 wrong way, wrong way. See, I can get you on there. Oh, no. It's trying to think of things, that, I'm trying to do the puzzle in reverse, and it's really tricky. No, there we go. There's two of them up there now. Okay, perfect. And then meet him up in the middle. Done it! Oh, and they're all little hearts! Oh, they found a monster, love! Oh. Well, that is a little bit cute, I suppose. Yeah, alright, fine. It is sweet that they've got monster love. Oh, they don't need to follow me anymore because they've found each other. Oh, why is this so sweet? It had no business being this sweet. Wait, hang on. Which way do I go? Reading it? I can't get to that button. It does look like there'll be an elevator there at some point, though, even though it's blocked. So I guess I'm going... I just realised there's a switch there as well. I have no idea what's happening here. This is like a, a small piece of puzzle that like, is going to... I don't know. Is that for future puzzles? That looks like there's a tram or trolley system. I don't know. I don't... Okay, let's go up. That looks like the way to go. There's a bell. Doesn't do anything. Coat rag creature. Turns the light off. That will open up the thing, I'm assuming. So I need to get it on that button, do I? That, that. But then I need to... Oh, I don't know. Wait, no, I need to get up there. I need to be on it. Right. So I need to stop pressing that. Sugar. I need to put one space between us. Two spaces between us. I've done that. I've done the reverse of what I need. One, two. No, but then it's going to reset it. One, two. That's how. One, two. Perfect. What did that button do? Just calls the lift again. Okay. And that button... 
Oh, didn't mean to do that. I'm still controlling the coat rack demon! Does that mean that I'm controlling the ones that aren't, like, in love throughout this entire world? Because that made me sad. Oh, hello. How do I get down? Can I get down? Yes, I can. Now, I'm about to do something very mean here. I'm going to end the episode before I jump in there. Because No, I'm not. I would never do that. Come on. Ooh. Oh. I would never do that. That's mean. Although, I do need to end the episode soon. There's a goat! Is that another mechanic? Please be a nice goat. Oh, he doesn't oh no, he's not a nice goat. Doesn't matter. It's a relego. Irrelevant. A relego. Fuck. Ignore me. So, good goat, bad goat? Oh, we just, it's a new mechanic. Should we have a look? See what it does first. Hang on. Are you a good goat? So, it's a scaredy goat. That's weird. So it stops on the grass. What do we think the grass? <laughs> what's what's the what's the goat gonna turn into? Oh sugar! Hang on, I I really need to end this episode here, but I really want to know what the goat turns into. I think, okay, so the mechanic of this seems to be we can chase the goat away, the goat can't kill us, it'll return to where its last grassy spot was, which means... No, I don't know. Oh, this is really tricky! I love it! I love that we're so far into this game already, and it's still inventing new mechanics. It's bloody brilliant! But yeah, as I said, this episode's going to run on for too long if I keep going here, so I'm going to leave this episode here if that's okay. Thank you everyone so much for watching this video. I am so... So loving this series. It's so charming, yet it well, it's really difficult. <laughs> you would have thought that this kind of mechanic of getting creatures to step on buttons via your actions would get a little bit tiring after, say, doing it three or four or five times, but it really hasn't. I'm getting the same sense of accomplishment from doing each puzzle, even though I'm up to what four hours so far into this series. It's just it's wonderful. I love it. <laughs> okay, so until the next episode, awesome possum. Bye, fluffies.